All right, so we're recording a little acoustic guitar here today. We've got my old trusty K. This is a 50s uh, K acoustic. Don't ask me what model it is. I just call it the baseball bat. And X, my man X O'Connor. How's it going? Co-producer. Is uh, micing it up using a Sound Deluxe U95. It's a really great mic for acoustic guitar. And uh, yeah, where, where are you placing this thing at? I'm going for right in here, kind of where the neck meets the body. So when you're talking about micing up an acoustic, is there any kind of like position or like sound you're looking for in particular with that? Um, for this particular song, we definitely want something really organic, really full sounding. So typically the more towards the body you go, the fuller the sound is going to be. The more towards the neck, the kind of more thinner, more articulate the sound's going to be. So right kind of where they meet, Gives you a nice balance between the two. So I try to stay about six, eight inches off the body so the sound develops a little bit. Okay, so, so do you have any advice if I got a splinter in my pinky finger? Uh, what to do about that? Put tape on it. Okay. Or put, put some of that it. liquid skin stuff on there. That's true. And, then, <laughs> and pray. So we're, re we're actually um, finishing up a production. It's a country thing that we had an awesome live band in here that just killed it on the track. And... The guy that was playing it was using these finger picks, which were really cool, but then once we got finished to the, the, the end of the production process, it's like, man, everything sounds so good, except for it sounds a little too metallic. So we're, we're just going through and recutting using fingers and a nice, warm, vintage-sounding acoustic. So that is a little bit in the life of recording tracks, miking up an acoustic guitar. I do love playing real instruments. We love recording real instruments. There's yeah. nothing that really replaces that. Native Instruments makes that strummed acoustic thing, but it doesn't replace having the real thing. So try it out.